Once upon a time, in the kingdom of Alamania, in a small, cozy town called Forest Hill, there lived a boy, son of a fisherman. The boy disappeared in broad daylight, and no one was able to find him for several days. At the same time, Leonor left the walls of the orphanage to become an apprentice of the elder of this town. What will her story be? Hello, where can I find the home of the local elder, Magnus? You already found it. It is there, on your right. Welcome to Forest Hill. Come in, it's open. Good afternoon. I'm Leonor from the Orphanage. Ah, you are the out. I'm not that out. I hope that you are. Alas. Is she kidnapping children? So far, only one. If you help me find the witch. Okay, I'll do my best. Take a break from the road and get comfortable. Tell me, please, where is the tavern? Come out through that gate to the square. Right in front of you will be the rose and the crown. Hello, do you have a free room? Darling, why are you- No room at all? I can't- Ah, so you're an apprentice to- It's okay, it doesn't- It's embarrassing for me to- Indeed, I don't have the- Here is what we'll do. Okay, I'll be back soon. The room must be very dirty.
It's dark and I can't see a thing. Maybe the owner of the tavern has a lantern. The basement is dark. How can I light it up? Do not use fire. I will give you... You found all the keys. Thanks. I Thank you for finding a room for me. Oh, no one has indeed lived here for a long time. Well, it's okay. I'll quickly fix the place up. a fireplace. It's the keeper. 
It contains various useful things. They can be opened on the same altar as the keeper. What an unusual hatch. Locked. I wonder if there's a key to it. Hello, you must be the tavern owner's son. Can you tell Yes, my name is- I'm Leonor. I have just- Wow, great. I would- Why? What happened? He was kidnapped. The missing boy. I feel- Well, now I have a golden pyramid. You found the pyramid. Put it on the base by the window. What should I ask it? Of course he will. <laughs> You're very cute. I think you are kind. Hmm, that's a good idea. Let's find... Leonore asked a question about the missing boy in her head, set up the pyramid, and peered intently at the dancing grains of sand. She saw in the sandy outline a boy fishing in a boat on a lake. Suddenly, a piercing scream sounded in her head. The boy disappeared, and some creature with a bizarre paw plopped into the lake. What did you see in the vision? There was some kind of creature. A creature? Um, I completely- Mom usually stores firewood.
What a beautiful, precious altar. I can open the keeper of the same type on it. Hey, it is not customary in our... I found a wallet nearby. Do you think it's possible? I brought coins. Seven, right? Yes, thank you. Great, they have brought my things already. Leonore's first day in the town was intense. She met a teacher, found a place to stay, and decided to help find the missing boy. She would sleep all day, but she was awakened by a loud knock on the door. Good morning. Your breakfast is already on the table, downstairs. Good morning. 
Breakfast is included in the price. Good morning. It seems like we never had the time to get to know- My name is Helga. What's the story with the missing child? Oh, terrible. This has already happened a couple centuries ago. Creepy story. Thanks for- Welcome to Godelof's treasure. Wow, there are so many. Hello, I am Rosa, an apothecary. Hello, I'm Leonore. I was Lake. There is one. There. Well, I'll think of some. Do you want to know something else? Not yet. Thanks. Hello, how are you? Have you settled in here? I settled down, thanks. Ha! Censor it. A pseudo- Okay, sorry. What- Find a book with the history- Thanks, but I- Feel at home here. Feel free to read book. Magnus has so many different interesting reference books in his closet. I think Magnus is testing me, but I know it's a genodia. If I sprinkle it with shimun pollen, have you returned? Is that shimun pollen on your account? It is. Of course, it's for sale. I brought six coins. Is there only one bottle? Unfortunately, yes.
Looks like you almost fixed the gate. They had almost? Is you still need a lever. They I'll try. Thanks. Everything unusual has a high price. Hello? Have they decided to open the gate already? I open them because- Yes, right across the field. I am Leonor. Thank you. This is exactly where the creature jumped in my vision. Such frogs can be temporarily repelled by a fetic root. I'll find the root and look for clues here. So that's the purpose of these wooden figurines of birds. These are the keys.
Magnus has a large library. There will certainly be a book about different creatures.
Got a loath? What do you know about wooden bird figure? To be honest, I don't... How much more do you have? That's the only one left. In general... Nine coins, just like you asked. Thank you for your purchase. It's getting dark outside. It's time to head back to the tavern. I'm very tired. I'll... On the second day, Leonore learned the legend of the child abducting witch and read about the Merchicks, mischievous water creatures. She was immersed in her thoughts of catching a Merchick and fell asleep while she was hoping to find a solution in the morning. Well, back to our Merchicks. If I soak the bread in infusion, it will be a good bait to lure the Merchick into a trap. I'll ask the owner of the tavern. Good morning, darling. Alas, breakfast is not... Good morning, Madred. Baker? There is one. Blacksmith? Great. He can help me with the trap. Hello, I was told that you bake bread. Not just bread, the best- I need buckwheat bread. I haven't baked buckwheat bread for a long time. I will also need to soak- That's not a problem. I'll think of something. Everything's always mixed up on these shelves, but if you're looking for something-
Nothing complicated. Magnus has some ingredients on the table. I just need to search the field for fragrant herbs and... Hello, do you have valerian juice and fragrant... You can collect fragrant herbs in the field. An important skill for a healer is to maintain common sense. Here, I can collect fragrant herbs. There is everything I need. Have you lost something? Oh no, I was just looking. You're smart, I see. Thank you. I will open it. Thank you. 
I need to soak the bread when it's ready in Javelier's... I will do it. Hot bread will easily... I need to make a trap. Madrid said... Maybe I can. For one creature... But the witch abducts children. trying to fix the bridge before the kidnapping, but then the search and panic began and the gates were closed, so the bridge is still broken. Maybe I can fix it. I just need to find the tools. You can take my toolbox from the shed. If you can fix the bridge, the people will be grateful to you. Thank <laughs> you. 
Good afternoon. Are you the miller? Hello. Yeah. Can you make me buck? Let's do it this way.
Take the coins. Thank you. I hope my price isn't too high. Is that enough? Yes, more than enough. Thank you. I hope... Great. Now the baker will bake me some bread. I'll go to the blacksmith. He probably came up with... I brought buckwheat flour. How fast can you make the- I'll manage until the evening. Can I help you? You can get a tray of eggs from my shelf. I found the tray of eggs. Excellent. Please take these em The baker asked me to give you the bags. Thank you. I've already been waiting. I gave the bags to the miller. Here is the flower he- Thank you. It seems that we live close. Look, it's simple. We take a large barrel, fill it with- I saw a big barrel in the market.
The resin must be melted to tar the barrel. I saw an old bucket on the shore. I need to find it.
To fix the barrel, I need new boards. I saw the
You did great. Almost done. A strong rope should be in Mordred's pantry. Darling, you've been out all day. It's getting... Oh, really? As I understand it. You could say so. Oh, someone would rather find... Thanks to the kindness of the local craftsman, Leonore made a trap for the merchant. When she got to the lake with the trap, the deep night had already fallen. Now I need to prepare a trap near the water. I hope it works. It is necessary to fill the barrel with water, or the merchant can become ill. Leonore set up a trap that she made with the help of the blacksmith and the baker. She had to wait patiently when the merchant, besotted by the smell of the fragrant infusion, would get into the trap. She spent the whole night near the lake before the villain finally appeared from the water. In anticipation of the delicacy, the merchant blindly jumped for the bread and fell into a trap. When she woke up from her sleep, Leonore quickly cut the rope. The prime suspect had finally been caught. The merchant turned out to be heavier than I thought. I'll ask the miller if I can borrow. Good morning, Edric. May I ask you to lend me a donkey? I would be happy to help. Let me do an exam. Take a look. It won't do any harm.
Mode's Spurge accidentally got into the hay that the donkey was eating. It seems that this grass is poisonous to animals. I need to ask Rosa. Hello, can you tell me if this herb is poisonous? It sure is. It's spur- Do you have any recipe? Yes, take it on the count. I saw lemon balm in the field. The baker should have baking soda and honey. I'm sure that I'll find blackberries and carrots. Excuse me, do you have baking soda? Of course. You can take some. Magnus isn't here yet. Strange. I thought he'd be back by now. Can I prepare medicine somewhere here? It of course. Don't be shy.
Here, I can weigh out the right amount of baking soda, but I need to assemble a set of calibrate. You can't pull the carrot out this way. Take my old shovel blade. I hope it helps in some way. Better than nothing. The shovel will be useful now, but I need to find a handle for it. It might be in the forge...
The medicine will be most conveniently prepared in the tavern. Wow, the donkey looks much better now. Look for a bridle in my barn to harness the donkey to a cart. Leonor cured the miller's donkey, and the miller helped her to take the merchant to the town. They had reached the market square by nightfall. It's getting late. I'll probably go back. Thank you. Madred didn't forget to leave me a bun, just as she promised.
Well, I hope that tomorrow I will solve. It was the first time Leonore had a chance to prove herself as a healer and herbalist. She cured the miller's donkey that was poisoned by Spurge. The captured Merchick slept sweetly in the barrel on the square, and nothing foreshadowed trouble. What happened? Are you okay? I was cleaning up the room on the... It must be the... What about Magnus? He's gone on his... Mardred, hold on. Now we'll pack... It turns out that Magnus was right. He said that the kidnappings would continue. Merchick, live. I caught him in the lake. Of course it's not his fault. But he was there. He... I was told that the local... How can I find him? You will leave the forge and pass the... daughter. I need to get to the edge of the My tree house is there and I love to play in it.
Thank you for opening the gate. No one has been there for a long time. I saw a brush cutter in the forge. It can be... Who are you? What are you doing here? I am Leonor. Magnus' apprentice. But why? I'm trying- I have nothing to do with this. Looks like it has something to do with the town hall clock.
I need to find the missing numbers and return them to their place.
This is one of the four heroes who stopped the Grey Overlord. Some strange material. Maybe there are other heroes' figurines somewhere else. I have almost no experience in blacksmithing. Well, if you did what it takes to help me, then I will help you. He is worried about something. Wind chimes? It's something like a bell. I'll ask the baker if he has cinnamon. May I borrow a few cinnamon sticks from you? Are you trying to be my competition? I found the wind chime scam in my notes. Thanks. 
I'll try to take care. There must be a suitable base in the clearing. I've already found several of these bells. If I can only remember where. I made a bell. Great. Now we can return to the square and listen to the Merchick. When the Merchick was pacified by the wind chime, he willingly shared everything he had seen. A few days ago, the merchant smelled bread in the boat where the boy was sitting. He was about to jump to steal the bread when terrible shadows suddenly appeared and rushed at the boy. The merchant hid. When he emerged, the shadows had already disappeared along with the boy. The merchant said that he had seen the same shadows in the square while he was sitting in a barrel. They were also chasing another boy that ran away from the town towards the fields. The merchant was very afraid of these shadows. He said that this was evil magic. He really wanted to go home.
but it can't be. I saw him in a vision. Mer chicks are physically in. Then things just. It's already night. You don't have to wander around the town. So... It's already quite dark. Perhaps. It was a terrible day. Dwarf Dwilia, the son of the tavern owner, had disappeared. Leonor had to get the support of Benegar, a stern hunter who lives on the outskirts, to question the Merchik. However, her hopes were not justified. The kidnapping was not the Merchik's fault. However, he turned out to be a valuable witness. I wonder if they found Dwilier. I need to ask... Good morning. How's it going with the search? It's not going very well. Sorry. I know this. Thank you, darling. Well, not every... Your optimism comforts me. Forgive me. The Merchick said that he had seen the boy running towards the fields. Leonore, where did you disappear? I had oh, I'm sorry. I've completely lost- I have a unique and most interesting invention in my attic. A Will the crown help to find the kids? What is- So many questions, but the best answers. I have already seen colored crystals both in the town and beyond. I have to remember the locations. It would be better to remove this stone with pliers not to damage it. They are at the forge. Thank you. 
Interesting animal. I've never seen one like it before. I'll read about it in the Book of Creatures when I get home. This animal can be used to search for Dwillier. I need to ask the baker if he can give me sugar. I have an unusual demand. I need something to- You can find some sugar on the shelf. Do you think he still has a leash? Quite possibly. He is an economical- Good afternoon. How long have you been in the field? I came recently. Today I was... Maybe you saw something unusual. No. Although there is a strange thing. What is that in the cage? A feather. If I find clay on the lake, I can... The crystal sits too tightly in the stone. I can only get it with a pickaxe.
One of the crystals I need is hidden inside the bird. I think the cache will open if I collect five golden feathers.
It's a venomous red-horned snake, and the crystal I need is right behind it. Maybe I can find something at the hunter's place to scare it away? Redhorn snake eggs are very rare and highly prized in alchemy. If I'm lucky, Rosa may buy it from me. Hello, can I get some money for this egg? Wow, okay, why not? Opening. I found all the crystals. Now the crown works. Perfect. Great. I saw a bloodhound weasel. In general, the idea is not... But what about the boy? Can we... Most likely the witch has already hit him. But what if the boy is still alive? Is it better to take the time? Okay. How else can I... You have already helped tremendously. Thank you. Since I have free time, I can look for the boy with the help of the animal. I'll ask Edric if he still has a leash. Hello, how can I help? The baker told me that you once had a blood. I had, but alas. Do you still have a leash? Can that I is all that's left. You can have.
Now I need to ask Margaret for some of Dwilier's things so that the Bloodhound Weasel can trace him. Modred, can you give me a personal item that Dwil- I can. I have his- Not yet, but I found a blood- Oh, the weasel. Well, I don't want to give up so easily. at the animal to the well. Is there a possibility that the boy hides there? Thomas, is there any way to get down into the well safely? Edric had a rope ladder. You can search in the mill. The boy has weak breathing, but he is still alive. After a tiring search, Leonor found Dwilia, but she wasn't the first one who did. <gasps> 
the huge cave spider was mad with rage. It chased her through the caves, longing to finish its supper, furious that someone had dared to disturb and interrupt it. Luckily, Leonore managed to find a hiding place. The last thing she saw before losing consciousness was the spider's futile attempts to reach her. When she woke up, the spider was gone. I need to get out of here and find help. I hope I can make it before it's too late. I need to return the bloodhound weasel to Benegar. At the same time, I will ask him for help with the spot. Please, help. I found Dwillier. We must help. We? I do not... Dwillier is the son of... So it was you who took my... I was attacked by a huge... I have better things. Oh no, Magnus is still looking for the witch. Well, I'll arm... I will sketch this drawing to make such a lantern. However, someone has to kill the spider and pull the boy out. I'll try to persuade Benegar. I really, really need your help. Please listen to me. You are very worried. I already know everything. Dark steel. Rongrim, I found Dwilia. He was caught by a huge... Wait, don't rush. I found him in a cave, which is in the... Vinegar, you better not keep company with him, but on the... Yes, I found it in a book. I can forge the base. For now, you can work on the... I saw new candles in the basement of the tavern. If I can find them, I can melt them down.
This is Liana the Dreamer, priestess of the Moon Goddess. She was one of those who stopped the Grey Overlord's invasion. Okay, there is the core. I'll ask the blacksmith if the base is ready. Here is the base for the lantern. Did you manage to make the core? Yes, almost everything is- My daughter plays with multicolored- I need to hang the lantern on some- The fisherman has one. The poor guy.
I need colored lenses from this lamp for a lantern. I made a lantern. Did you manage to find the right weapon? Yes, I found arrow. I saw a red horn snake. It will do. You can. I 
need a suitable jar to collect the poison. I can look for it at Magnus's. I brought the poison. Good. Now I will apply it. Leonore returned to the spider's lair with some help. She and Beniger prepared everything that would help to deal with the spider. The lantern hypnotized and immobilized the spider. The hunter fired a poisoned black steel arrow. A well-aimed shot hit the spider and it fell dead. Leonore quickly released the boy Beniger put him on his shoulder, and they left the cave together. This doesn't look good. The spider has injected poison. Is there anything we can- I can go in search of a rare fruit. I will make the comp. The recipe is on the alchemy table. I can handle it. I have no doubts about your abilities. I need to collect all the ingredients as soon as possible. Can't reach. I wish I could remember where I left the net.
It's difficult to go down to these rose hip bushes. I need a ladder. I can't pull out the root with my hands. I need to take a shovel. Can I borrow your shovel again? You can, but I've already put all the tools in the barn. I need to fix the ladder somehow. Maybe there's something suitable in the blacksmith's shed.
I'll sit here, in case he will feel worse. I'm so tired. <sighs> Leonor, together with the hunter, pulled the boy out of the cave. But the spider's venom continued to kill him. Magnus said that the juice of a special fruit could help, and went looking for it. Leonor put a compress on the boy and fell asleep due to the exhaustion. Has Magnus returned? No, he was out all- Modred, he will live. Of course, of course, it's- a I just need to find some records of Magnus about the habitat.
Hello, I'm looking for such runes. Do you have it? Interesting. I saw one just like- If we talk about the cost? Okay, I'll look for it. Can you help? I brought milk. Did you manage to find the rune? Oh, thank you. Yes, I found it. This is a figurine of Raka emerald skin, a drag-
It looks like this is the Karia tree, but I need its fruit juice, which means that I need to take it very carefully. I saw a suitable tool in the Miller's barn. I should rather get back to the town as soon as possible and give to Olier. Now he will be alright. He will get better. He just needs to rest. Yes. Leonor had to solve more and more complex tasks, but she did not lose heart. She saved the tavern owner's son through her perseverance. Her well-deserved rest was interrupted by the sound of bells and the acrid smell of smoke. What happened down there again? The bells are ringing, it's not good. Is anyone injured? Do you need my help? A little help won't hurt. We need- This is a blue flame. We- Blue flame. I read it- We still need a lot. But if we move away, the fire will spread- Maybe I can fix the tower. Maybe you can. There should be a vision- Duillier feel? Is he any better? Yes, but he needs rest.
I recently saw the first detail in the basement of the tavern. Soap root can often be found in such an area. It's strange that Magnus never came back. Can something have happened to him?
Leonore sailed away across the lake to inspect the shore, which was inaccessible because of the dense forest. When Leonore stepped ashore, it became clear that the lake was in a lowland. She looked up, and something interesting caught her attention. There was an island visible behind the cliff, but the bridge to the island was destroyed. Previously, the old city was located on this island. Humans, dragonoids, she moon, and dwarves flocked here from all over the empire to share their knowledge with the other races. However, as the empire split, the old city fell victim to racial and land strife. The place, which was a symbol of unity, was destroyed. Wow, this is not the place that I imagined when I read about it, but it is beautiful. scarlet halidus berries, which allow you to breathe underwater. No wonder they are so well hidden. They are very rare. How do you feel? Very dizzy. 
nauseating. I wouldn't have made it without vinegar. I was just playing in the pantry. Did they throw you into the well? No. I escaped and... Did the shadows find you? Shadows did not. You are very brave and smart. Do you know what happened? Fire, but not a simple trouble. We this is what I'm doing now. I have a part in it. I'll look for it. Thanks. Thank you. 
Could this gingerbread be the cause of the kidnapping? Another gingerbread at the place of the kidnapping? Apparently Magnus was right. This is the same witch that it was 200 years ago. Is flowing. I should close it for now so that it does not pour in vain. I will need a long hose. I saw such hose somewhere in the mill area. was put out after some time.
I sympathize with you about the burnt house. Well... Freya. What happened? Everyone says she... What do you have in mind then? No, not a... I will inspect the ashes. Maybe... This is not... It seems to be. I'm not sure, but it looks like a Shamoon flower that holds memories. Ordain must know for sure. Tell me, please, do I understand correctly? That's right, it is. I found it in the ash. It records images, but it was badly done. Oh. Can I, I know only one. Is there any way to get there? I inherited a seal from my father. A new misfortune in Forest Hill. The house where the blacksmith's daughter played was lit up with blue fire. Only a memory flower was found in the ashes. The baker said that it can be restored with the moon mist that can be found in the old city. Leonore decided to do it first thing in the morning. It's time to find the old city. That's a sound lock. I need to change the string to make it work.
pigeons won't let me look around. I need to distract them. I saw the same valve in Edric's garden when I took the host there, and some notes appeared on the parapet.
Mm, Magnus is still missing. Did his search really lead to something? There is a golden note on this display case. I saw a figurine in Magnus's attic that will open it. The acid in the blacksmith's shed. Thank you. 
These are the four heroes who stopped the Grey Overlord. In memory of their sacrifice, the Order of the Grey Guard was created. It was almost three centuries ago. It's already dark. I'd better go back to the room and rest. Leonore opened the way to the old city. There were a lot of curiosities, hiding places, and historical relics waiting for her. Alas, she could not figure out where to find the moon mist, but she found a strange pendant. Will her Dan be able to help her to restore the memory flower? The raven pendant looks unusual. Maybe her Dan... I got to the old city and found the sanctuary. There Moons are a popular talisman that are fairly easy to find. I think that I saw such moons in the Hunter's... Even before most races were... I have a Black Raven pendant on my shelves. Look Sorry for asking so many questions. It's okay. You're doing well.
A memory flower or pitched here, but the writing is not legible. There is a potion that restores the ink. I'll look for the recipe in Magnus's attic. Why does Magnus take so long to return? I saw blue algae in the cave lake. I need to return for it.
Looks like the old Shamoon language. I hope the baker can read it. Can you read a manuscript in the ancient Shamoon language? I'll try. It's about the memory. The moons on the bowl must be connected by a... Leonore restored the memory flower in the bowl. Shi Moon's magic worked. A vision lit up her mind. She only saw confused fragments of memories. Freya playing in the treehouse. Open shutters, the silhouette of either a bird or a man, and a large, unfamiliar golden feather that was untouched by blue fire. Golden feather. I hope I can read in the book of creatures to whom it belongs.
The hunter probably has a hawk feather. I can find the pearl in one of the shells underwater. Leonore restored the memory flower and saw a series of vivid visions. One of them contained the feather of a strange bird. She found out that this feather belongs to an alkanost, half a bird, half a woman. She can be summoned with the help of a special ritual. So there was a real hope that the girl was safe and could be found. Alkanost will help to find out the fate of the girl. I will perform the ritual at the side of the fire because the last time she appeared there.
Leonore performed the summoning ritual, and Alkanost appeared. She told the story of her friendship with Freya and the events of that ill-fated day. Freya bit the gingerbread, and eerie shadows flew out from it. This was dark magic, undoubtedly. Alkanost could only attack them with blue fire, but it flew through and set the treehouse on fire. The shadows were not damaged. Freya ran outside, and the shadows grabbed her immediately and dragged her into the forest. Alkanost rushed in pursuit, but alas, it was no use. The shadows disappeared without a trace, along with the girl. According to Alkanost, Freya may be alive. I need... Rongrim, Freya is alive. The fire... Gingerbread? I suspect... No, no. I didn't want you to think that at all. Yes. What a misfortune that... The he didn't plan any of these. A two-faced scoundrel. Never... Apparently, all the missing children bit the gingerbread. The timing could be coincident. To test the gingerbread and see... You'll need to create a reagent potion. I've got... The if the reagent turns purple after applying... Sorry, the set is incomplete. Once I bought such pigments from wandering artists, but they have not visited us for a long time.
I need to collect all the ingredients. The shells should be at the bottom of the cake lake, and the salt can be evaporated from the blue stalactite. I need a piece of this stalactite, but it's very high. A strong blow or a small explosion will help me to break it off. Do you have something to blow up the stalactite in the ca- An interesting problem you have there. to aim explosives directly to this stalactite. Maybe Benegar can lend me some kind of device for this. Can you help me? I need to throw the explosive vial very- You just won't stop, will you?
it is necessary to melt a piece of the stalactite at a high temperature to get salt in the sediment. What is living water? Where can I get it? I think her Dane should know. He already made this reagent. You must be the son of Erdane. Where is he? Yes, I am Nimeril. Oh no, it's all because of me. A beautiful name, but as far- Thank you. I will try to prove that they- I'm sure the children were kidnapped by the witch. On the main square, but the- I need to get there somehow. Look, I'm left alone with my sister. Hey, stop! No one's allowed to enter. It's the middle of the night. You should go to sleep. Maybe I can put the guard to sleep. Surely God Aloth is sitting in the tavern now. I need to talk to him. Godalith, I need help. The baker was put in prison because- Guarded? Ha! Can you share a sleeping potion with Unfortunately, a li- Lulling flowers? Luckily, they-
Margaret hides the tap from the barrel of wine in the pantry when she leaves for business, so that no one could pour himself. Not like there were incidents. Fireflies at this time should be on the lake. They can be lured to the syrup of solar sugar. I think the baker has it.
Thank you. I managed to find both seeds and buds. Excellent. Take the seed. Board here. Would you like some wine? What a stupid question, of course. I did an experiment, and the water turned purple. You must help me find the witch. No. But I did everything you said. She wouldn't hurt anyone. Why are you protecting her? She... She charmed him. It's obvious. She made him a puppet. I see traces of witchcraft on him. Let's go. There's no point in talking to him. The baker said that he would help find the witch if the gingerbread was created with dragonoid magic. Leonore conducted an experiment and proved it, but the baker had already been put in a prison. Magnus said that he was enchanted by the witch. The threads to the missing children were eluding one after another. I used the crown, but it never worked. Apparently, Is there any other way to find- I figured out how to strengthen the crown. We only fear what we do not understand. is very delicate. I need to assemble a set of jewelry tools, and I can look for magical sand in the van. Artists often use it in their performances. Hmm, the emerald is broken. Can I try another stone? Thank you. 
I found part of such a stained glass window a long time ago. It should lie in my barn. I've already seen parts of this bas relief. I need to remember their locations and collect them.
It's impossible to break it down. I need to pull out the crystal with some tool. There must be something suitable in the blacksmith's place. In the old city cache, Leonor found a protective bracelet created by the masters of the past. As soon as she put it on, the protective magic was activated. 
and showed her an eerie vision. In that vision, Magnus was filled with rage and went mad, as if he had been possessed by a great evil. The vision dissipated, but the horror that fettered Leonore's soul told her that she saw it for a reason. Hmm, this signet seems to open something in the bakery. My little sister was kidnapped right from the bakery. You must be on the verge of despair. I believe... This is my sister's bag. She wouldn't have gone anywhere without it. Gingerbread again. I don't believe this is a coincidence. It must be the witch. This is a figurine of Gerhard the Ebon Blade. That was the name of the human archmage who contributed to the protection of the world from the Grey Overlord. Second key. I'll go to the blacksmith and see if he can forge the same one. Rongrim, I need an exact copy of this key. Can you make interesting key? I... I think I can find and bring them. You should try. Leave the key. With
I brought everything you need. Thank you. Can you? Of course I will help. What Ever since she disappeared, I can't sleep at all. My heart. The most important treasure in this shop is me. Hello. Ron Grimm sent me for a sedative. Is it already over? Yeah, but there is still... We all hope that. Good luck to you. I brought your medicine. Rose looked worried. You don't know how I feel right now. At the beginning of the Earth Age, Jacob the Madman made a fatal mistake in the ritual. He let the Grey Overlord into this world who craved power and greatness. The southern human kingdoms fell to him. The passage through the South Ridge was left undefended. The battle against the Grey Army was doomed. As the troops became weaker, the Grey Army became stronger. It subjugated every living thing that came across its path. The four greatest mages of their races allied to prevent the inevitable defeat. They came up with a ritual that could tear the very fabric of the universe. They banished the Grey Overlord beyond the realm of the world at the cost of their lives. The magical seals closed the rift and created a defense that would not allow the Grey Overlord to return. The security of this world now depended entirely on the integrity of these seals. When I was little, they often read this book to me in the monastery. Thank you. 
The first chain was in the bag of Nimeril's sister. It is worth going to the bakery. Make... Tell me, do you have such a chain? I really need it for the... Yes, I will give it to you. Do you know where he hid it? It's... I know. It's in the cache behind the logs. The crown is ready. Now I can rest. Magnus assumed Leonore the task of improving the crown. However, she had started to suspect that he was not particularly interested in the fate of the missing children. The baker's daughter also disappeared. Nimril said that his father used the crown along with some kind of map. Apparently, he knew the witch. Therefore, Leonor was determined to keep the crown for the time being and continue the search for the children. Darling, Magnus has come to see you. He says that he wants to talk to you about something urgently. Get down. Thanks, I'm on my way. Well, did you improve the crown? There was plenty of time. Um, almost? So quickly, get on with it. The witch is almost... I must quickly go to Nimoril. I hope I can find the map that his father used.
Hey, did you manage to find a clue? Yes, there are some numbers.
I still don't get it. Maybe there is some clue on the back? I saw a stencil with the same symbol on my dad's shelves. Judging by the images, this clue should help to open the cache. I want to... I can try to exchange coins at Godeloth's store for the denomination I need. Can you exchange this coin? I need one for 25 and- I can exchange 50.
Dad moved the crown over this map and looked through it at the figures. It doesn't work. Probably this is because some details are missing. There is a basket of candy in the tavern. Maybe I can find the right candies there. Hello, may I take some candy from your counter? Of course, you helped us. Are these candies in the basket? Look in the pantry. I have a lot. must be the way to the witch's house. There is a pond with swans and a clearing with wild strawberries in the forest near the hunter's place. I need to go there with this map. The gingerbread map worked. The crown with the compass opened a portal to the witch's hideout. Leonore closely followed the movement of the revived gingerbread man and repeated his route exactly. One mistake, and the house would have remained hidden, as it would be in front of Magnus and other residents.
magic of the map led her to the right place, and the witch's house opened before her. It was so deep in the forest that she would have had to walk for several days without the portal. When Leonor looked out of the forest, she saw with her own eyes how the witch, wrapped in a robe, grabbed the boy and locked him in a magical trap. another kidnapped child. I have to free him. The witch hid the child somewhere around here, but how can I open a passage to the bunker? Leonor dispelled the witchcraft and opened the trap. But as soon as she took the boy by the hand to take him away, familiar shadows enveloped him. The witch ran out of the house and desperately shouted after her son. Why? Why did you bring evil in? But... I thought... I do not understand anything. There are missing children in Forest Hill. Me? I have never kidnapped... These are not my gingerbreads. I don't make them... Why did you try so hard? We, Dragonoids, have very... Visions? What was in these visions? I can show you. 
I have sketched it. I know this place. It's a tapestry in Magnus's house. I need to go there and check it out. What was that? I need to get back to the witch. She may know that magic and how to deal with it. I came to Magnus's house. There was a secret door behind the ta- Shadows. Such magic has been banned. Is there any way to remove this spell from the- I can help you see the spell, but- Is there any way for me to do it? I'm sure that there is. How can I see the spell? The candies in my yard are not- How can I make this black water? I will prepare the black water myself. It is difficult. I saw the place in the picture. These are ruins at the bottom of the cave lake. I need to examine them to find the crystal.
I need something very sharp to separate part of the candy. Benneker probably has the right tool in the clearing. Here is a black water. Put the lens in the bowl and fill it with water so that the lens is well saturated. This book may hold the key to unraveling what is going on. It remains to figure out how to turn off the protective field.
I need to tell the witch about this dark ritual. What happened? I tried to find my son with magic. I found a strange magical book. Security seal. What should I do? Before the magic attacked me, I reached the... A strange astronomical instrument in Magnus's house with a similar pattern. Judging by the recesses, I need to place five certain elements. It seems to be a stone from the pedestal in the cave, but mine is broken. Can the witch know something about such stones? I found and assembled the stone. It is large, smooth, and has a griffin. Sounds like stuff. Can I do this? Yes, the stuff. But first. So that's what this is about. When you go to Vinegar, ask him for a new purple candle. He should definitely have one. Vinegar, it's Magnus. Magnus kidnapped the- I knew. I told- And one more thing. The witch- The witch. Her name is Akra, and I have- Thank you. 
Four hours left before the rise. Akra, good to see you. Are you okay? I will be. I'm also pleased to see you. I hope you can help the girl. So, that's the ritual that these candles are needed for. I've never seen it. Try to use a knife. This resin should break easily. Move away. I'll deal with them now.
I have three more hours before the red moon rises. Look, a drawing appeared on the rock. Everything seems to be too simple. I need to check if there is some kind of protective spell here as well. Leonore and Beniger went out to the site of the ritual. Beniger demanded he hand over the children, but Magnus did not respond. It was no longer Magnus. Someone else controlled him. He brought down the stone on the bridge with a powerful spell. Leonore managed to run away, but the hunter stood too close. He couldn't stay on the fragments of the bridge and fell into the cliff. 
Magnus went deeper into the cave, as if nothing had happened. The red moon will rise in an hour. I need... I need to get back to the Dragonoid. There! Magnus! He turned into someone. Poor fellow. I need to remember. Explosive liquid can provoke a large... I can take explosive liquid. I must have something suitable. Look in the next room. I got the explosive liquid. There are two instructions on the wall that will help me to figure out how to make a bomb.
Leonore entered the cave as the moons merged, and bloody light filled everything. Magnus was consumed by the ritual. Magnus is engrossed in the ritual and doesn't see me. I'll try to free the kids before he notices me. has been removed from the child. Consciousness regaining will take time, but I will use it to free the others. Leonore freed the children with the help of a glove and commanded them to get ready and run together out of the cave. When Magnus felt that the magic was weakening, he turned to find out the reason and saw Leonore. Magnus cast a destructive spell on her, but the protective bracelet saved the girl. It surrounded her with a shield that took the damage away. Magnus prepared to cast his spell again, but Benegar appeared from behind, grabbed him, and dived into the ritual well with him. There was no time to think. The magic dissipated, and Leonore led the last child, the son of the fisherman, to the exit. The well erupted, and a magical explosion rocked the cave. Everything around started to fall apart. Leonore saved all four children. It seemed like a good ending to a terrible story, but no one guessed that this was not the end. It was necessary to sacrifice the blood of all four races to remove the seal. Magnus's plan failed, but despite everything, the conditions of the ritual were still fulfilled. 
distant ancestors of Magnus were she moon and dragonoids. Benegar's ancestors were dwarves and humans. Therefore, their blood was enough for the ritual. The first seal was broken, and the Grey Overlord was one step closer to returning to this world. When the jubilation about the return of the children subsided, Leonor decided to stay in the town. She became the local herbalist and alchemist instead of Magnus. The inhabitants of the town gave her land to build her own house. Life in Forest Hill continued to go on as usual.